Let me read for you uh, the rapture in Revelation 14, verse 14. And I looked, and behold, a white cloud, and upon the cloud one sat like unto the Son of Man, having on his head a golden crown, and in his hand a sharp sickle. And another angel came out of the temple, crying with a loud voice to him that sat on the cloud, Thrust in thy sickle and reap, for the time has come for thee to reap, for the harvest of the earth is ripe. And he that sat on the cloud thrust in his sickle on the earth, and the earth was reaped. Now, this is obviously the rapture. Why? Because we have Jesus coming in a cloud. It says the Son of Man came with a cloud. And then we have him reaping the earth. Now, the Bible says in Matthew chapter 13 that the reapers are the angels, the harvest is the end of the world. And he talks about how the good seed, the children of the kingdom, God's people, the, the saved, born-again Christians, they are the wheat. And the, the children of the devil are the tares or the weeds. And the Bible talks about how the wheat is going to be gathered into God's barn. God's going to harvest the wheat into his barn. Now, in Revelation 14, that's exactly what we see. We see Jesus Christ come in the clouds and he reaps the harvest of this earth. That is a reference to the rapture. It's in Revelation 14, verses 14 through 16. And it fits perfectly in the timeline of the book of Revelation, where it goes tribulation, then the rapture, then God's wrath is poured out.